Hi all, how you doing? Hope you're doing great wherever you are in the world. So daily champion today is Quentin Robert. Last time we played against him, everyone struggled. So uh, let's play him. Play daily. Uh, let's get rid of that. Okay. Pass, pass, 6, 12, 18 count. All right. Uh, yeah, I'm going to open a heart. Bit two, no trumps, maybe. Looks like I'm doubling this. Two spades weak. Six, seven, eight, nine. Four spades probably means partner's void. And I've got no points in spades. Mm -hmm. Let's get partner avoid in spades and a couple of kings. This is a massive hand. That's all I need. Three plus hearts. Two spades. That's six, most likely. Be nine, ten. Hmm. Six spades. What are we going to get? We get 420, 450. We've got to stop them getting eight tricks. They're going to get six without even blinking. And if East has got some shortage somewhere, or even a bit of length in diamonds, I think they're going to get, you know what? I'm going to, I'm going to bid five hearts. Yeah. So look at the diamonds. They're going to win a lot of tricks in diamonds. Six, nine. Yeah. Now what are you going to do? A heart, five, ten. So I can play in rough two spades. I can play ace, queen of clubs and another club. I mean, flies. Um, I think I can just draw the trumps here. Yeah. I think I might have missed a slam here. Maybe I should have considered the slam. I did slightly consider it, but um, I'm going to get the rest of the tricks. Don't know if that's good or bad. He did the same thing. Wow, that's interesting. They never bid four spades against him. <sighs> Must confess, I really did think about a slam because, having said that, the King of Diamonds is offside. So a diamond lead overtake and a diamond switch. Sorry, a spade lead and a diamond switch, but I'm still going to play the clubs like I did. Uh, right. Blackboard, anyway. I have to have a look at how much four spades goes off. But I think they've got a good diamond holding weather, and especially the diamond being offside. Anyone who likes them playing four spades doubled is going to get a bad score because it's, it's, it, it's not going to go too, more than two off. And I think quite a will, a lot will. Six, seven, ten. Interesting how the robots bid differently against uh, each of us. It's a bit annoying, I've got to say. Okay, one club. So I'm going to bid a spade rather than a diamond. Two no trumps, 18, 19. Okay, clear cut, three no trump bid here. No interest in spades, obviously. I've only got four. So we've got four diamond tricks. The lead doesn't help us one iota. We've got queen nine of hearts. So this is a good holding in hearts. 
we want to try and pick up three tricks or something in hearts, hopefully. Seeing so if I play queen, king, a. So if I play queen, small, small, looks like double. Four, five, six, seven, eight. Right, so we're looking, really, we want to try and make 10 tricks here, or 11 tricks. The club finesse is working, that's <clears throat> that's okay. And I think about the best way to play these hearts, and I think it might be small hearts of the queen nine. Queen, king, queen, small, small, king, nine. Yeah, so... I'm going to win with this and play a small heart and see what happens. Right, this hand hasn't gone in with the king. I'm going to go in with the queen, uh, the nine. Play this hand for the, yeah, that's bad news. Okay, going to have to duck that. Okay, so now we can go in with the ace. And play a 10, I guess. Small to the 10. Oh, you know what I should have done? Oh, wow. That's not very good, Bridge. You've just given me a free finesse. So, Ace, Queen of Diamonds, I can overtake. The Nine of Spades is a winner. King, Jack of Clubs. I've got the rest of the tricks. I can just claim now. I don't know if this is good or not. Yeah, it looks like going on the Queen of Hearts is best, but um Okay, we got a draw out of that. Seven, eight, nine. Another pass. One club pass, one heart. Good bit of spade. Partner might have some values. Um, yeah, this is jack to five. I don't want to spade lead and mess up the lead. Um, if it could give away a trick or something, if partner leads like king of spades from king x or something like that, and they've bit a spade anyway. So, what's going on here? Do I double this? Um, well, my king of clubs is in a bad position. I'm just going to pass. So it looks like East has got an opening hand with 4-4 four, four in the majors. Not going to double it. Partner doubles it. Obviously, I'll leave it in. Okay. Club spare. So no reason not to go with the ace. And then <clears throat> send back another diamond. Uh huh. So they've got ace ten, so they can finesse my ten of spades, uh, jack of spades. So they've got the king here. Uh mm huh. -hmm. Wow. I don't know, I maybe I've played the wrong card there. I can't think what's happened here. I think my partner's got the Ten of Diamonds or something. Ugh. Could be bad that if he's doubled it and taken it one off. Oh, wow. 
two no trumps plus one. It feels like the bots, uh, it looks like he's probably lost that because of the way the bots have bid, but we'll, we'll have a look. Six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. feel like I should have probably taken that two off. Got a mistracked, uh, lost track of the diamonds there. Uh, five, nine, ten, twelve. So I have a double, our uh, partner could bid diamonds, but I do have both the majors. It's kind of a bit of a gamble. If partner's got a four card major, then if I double, we can find that. But um, I'll just pass anyway. Partner's a past hand, so. Wow. Two clubs. Wow. Partner's got the majors. Ooh. So I can lose ace king of clubs and an ace of diamonds. Partner must have, you feel. Well, it doesn't must have. I mean, partner's got the king of spades and the ace of hearts and the ace of diamonds. Oh, they could have shortage in clubs. Are they likely to have shortage in clubs? Could do. East could well have seven clubs here. That's only like 10. Partner's got a singleton club. So I could bid four clubs, say, partner, choose your major. I could, uh, what's double here? Let's just see what double is here. Uh, that's kind of partner hoping to uh, let them choose. The big question is, um, do I want to stay off game? King of spades. Ace of Hearts. I mean, Pan's got a King of Spades and the Ace of Hearts, a singleton club and two diamonds, which is a good shot. You know, I'm just going to bid four clubs, I think. Hmm, that's slam try in clubs. Let's see what four diamonds is here. I suppose that'll be diamonds. Four spades, two plus game values. Splinter. I want to bid four clubs and say partner pick a major. Slam try game forcing. But in hearts, I suppose I could get them to bid four hearts. Get them to bid and then they've got to lead something. Partner's never going to bid a slam. Let's just do that then. I want partner to bid four hearts. There we go. They're past hands, so they're never going to go to slam. So we've got two diamonds to lose. Nine card fit. Diamonds twice. Feel like I should just run the Queen of Spades. Two two break. Okay, well, interesting. That sets up my nine of diamonds. And we can climb. Okay, you bit it as well.
Yeah, I felt like East had seven clubs. It's a good chance that was the case. Okay, last board. Five, six, ten, eleven, twelve. Six, ten, and twelve. So the question is, do I bid two clubs here, game force? Or do I bid a heart? I think I'm gonna game force. Mm -hmm. Let's see what this is. This can still be weak. Three to six diamonds, no trump opening hand. Right. Let's see what three hearts is here. What I'm forcing for one. Okay. Good. Okay, so I can put the 10 in, and maybe that'll win. I think I've got to, haven't I? I've got to try that. You know, this hand looks pretty awful, doesn't it? Uh, I'm not going to have time to set these things up. I'm going off. I do believe I'm going off. Hold on a minute, hold on a minute, hold on a minute. Hold on a minute. Can I set up for... Wait on a minute. Uh, uh, tricky one. Forget a spade player. Win with that. Now, I've got to play the Ace of Diamonds. This is actually really tricky. I've got to hope, really, that the club, the Ace of Clubs, is falling in two. I think I've got to play that. Ugh. Yuck. Hope that's not 4-1 now. And this could get ducked. Yeah, this is not good. I'm getting a bad score here. Three. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Oh no, I could get could make this. Three, four, five, six, seven. I got a feeling the clubs are gonna be four one. They've gone up with the ace of clubs straight away. And the diamonds are five one. And this hand's played eh, yeah, of course, I don't know. I've got no choice here but to do this anyway. Shall we now? There we go. So this hand's out of diamonds. This hand's probably got the ace of hearts. I'm going to get a bottom here. This is the power of aces. Aces are super important. Do I just play the jack of hearts now? Probably. I could not get any more tricks. I might not get any more tricks, though. One diamond pass. East is West has come up with ace, king of spades. Uh, so this is a critical decision now. Do I cash my jack of clubs just to get two off only? I could just lose the rest here. Jack of hearts. They've cashed the spades. Throw away. Jack of hearts. Oh, I think I'm still going to get one trick.
No, I'm not. Disaster. Should I just cash my trade? I'm definitely going to lose now. Did he go two off? Did he not go there? He went two off. Oh, God damn it. 283. That was a huge, huge difference there, that five points. That would have boosted my score up a lot. I should have just settled for, for being two off. Bit unlucky. I mean, I need the spades to be 4-4, four, four, and then... then um... You know what? Oh. It's, it's a bit unlucky, because one diamond opening, and this hand hasn't bid a spade or anything like that, but a um, bit of a trashy spade suit. Damn it. Gutted. I should have just cashed my thing. I was trying to get two more tricks just in case there was a chance that West had. Nah, I mean, Jack of Hearts. I mean, they could have just had one more spade, the top spade, and then I think I've got a chance still. So look at the leaderboard. Yeah. 25. Oh, wow. Someone got 40. Wow. Steve got 40. Wow. Amazing. Hold on, Steve. I should have got 30, but, you know. Uh, that zero doesn't mean he's actually got zero. It could just mean he's playing at the moment. Yeah, so what's got 30? Well done. Right, 286. Where does 30 get you? Because, uh... oh yeah, where does 30 get you? Actually, where was the 40 the lead? So Steve, Steve's won. Well done, Steve. Awesome job. I thought I played pretty solidly apart from that last board where I just, yeah, I think I did okay, but who knows. When I analyze it now, it might be that I've uh, made quite a few mistakes. So quite a lot in 30, 30 points, 248. So Quentin didn't do quite as well as he did the first time around. That's quite a few 25s here. Blimey, how many 25s are there? Maybe there's something weird going on here. 5-5-9, wow. I thought I played pretty good there. I thought I played a good set, apart from the last board. Maybe people bid a slam on this one. Two hearts, four hearts. They just opened a week too. Hmm. Reno Trumps plus one. Felt like I could potentially get more, but yeah, it says I hear you can only make one over trick. I suspect that me losing the heart. I got it back anyway, later on anyway. All right, he's playing spades. He won that and then played a spade. Mm. Well, I suppose, in fairness, spades is your longest suit. <laughs> I'm actually playing my uh, six card suit, but it's a four two, and the high, pips are quite high. But I think you're going to be a bit of if you play the spades, you're potentially in a bit of trouble if the spades break four two. And he's played the seven, eight nine. Eh, he's got this seven eight nine thing, right? Okay, he's run the seven.
Oh, that's a bit of a weird play, isn't it? Play this. You want to this? Shouldn't he play the six? Play the eight, nine. Uh, not sure. Tricky one. I'm not sure I like playing that suit first. You kind of go in for a three three break, which is thirty six percent. I think you come under a bit of trouble if they break four two, maybe. But uh, I don't know. You've got you do have quite high spades ten seven six nine. Yeah, it doesn't make any difference what card I put in. Right. Board three. I got the win. Two no trumps plus one. So they had a different bidding sequence here. Ah. They never found the spade fit because he decided to overcall a spade. I just didn't fancy this. Um... I don't really, you know, if this hand bids an Trump, do I want a spade? I'm not sure I do, necessarily. It could be right. We could lead diamonds. So I just didn't fancy a spade. So that's why he stopped the spade bid. And then um, they just stayed in two no trumps, which seems, seems reasonable. Ooh, this looks like a fun auction. One club, double. I don't like the diamonds. Uh, clearly, he's uh, going for it. Partner bids four clubs, pick a major, double, pass. Redouble, really pick a major, partner. Four hearts. Yeah, I'm, I'm not sure about this, this double business. Yeah, I, I'm a bit questionable about some of his bids, if I'm honest with you. Uh, right, one diamond, one heart. Right, fair enough. He bids a heart. Don't blame him there. I've got a couple of jacks, which are a bit naff. So I've overbid my hand, I guess. But then again, you know, he's he's just gone from one no trump to three no trumps anyway. So if you're going to do that, I think you might as well just bid two clubs and two hearts. I play a heart first. Oh, hold on. I feel like I can make this contract, maybe. No, you can't. This has got two aces. Don't think you can ever make it. You can, though. It says you can make it. Oh, God. Play the ace of diamonds. Uh, I've played the king. I mean, I was worried about playing this king because obviously if the clubs break 4-1, it's bad news. So I've got to play the ace of diamonds. And then maybe play a heart. But then you... Um... If you play a heart, you get rid of your uh, entry into that hand. Although you can play out that suit straight away, I guess. Diamond heart. Wings of the ace. Plays a dark club back. There's a spade, ace king. Huh? Still got the ace of clubs. Hold on a minute. Let's say you play a heart back. Okay, let's just do it. I did actually play the ace of diamonds. Now, what do I play next? Because he played the king of clubs, didn't he? Right. <laughs> Okay, yeah, right. Look at this. You've got to play a low club. Well, that's not happening. I felt like the heart back wasn't going to help you. Well, you're never going to play this small club here in a million years. 
you got to see through the backs of the cards to do that. So you're always going two off here. But I went three off because I was trying to go for it. Okay. Interesting set of boards anyway. I got a draw. Last time I got 10 against him, so this time I got 25. So that's a bit better anyway. 